background um, I got my tooth pulled last week and I mentioned on Twitter that um, when I woke up I immediately said that I wanted longhorn uh, ch firecracker chicken wraps and a baby and apparently without missing a beat I pointed at the tech and I said but you're paying for it so um, yeah, that's funny. And then Longhorn sends us a gift card for date night. <laughs> so that was really amazing of them and really sweet. It's one of our favorite date night places like for just a, a quick something that we trust we really like. Um, so yeah, we're gonna enjoy that. Yay. Oh my God, these are what I live for. They're so good. I could eat this whole plate by myself, but I'm nice, so I'm gonna share it. So, I have really bad luck with steak. For some reason, it, they always undercook it. And it's not just me, it's, I asked Billy, and he's like, no, yeah, that is undercooked. So they did that tonight, but this time when they brought it back to me, it was like greasy and wet, which is really weird. So they were like doing super customer service mode tonight, like like surveys and everything. So the manager comes over and he, he's just like, I just want to check on your steak. So I couldn't lie to him that it came back so bad. I mean, he could see it. And so he's like, oh no, I'm so sorry. So he's like, we'll take that off for you. Do you want any other steak? Like we can get you like a really nice steak or something. And I was like, well, it's the end of our meal. So I, I that's just fine. I appreciate it. And he's like, well, let's get you dessert or something. So he like helps me pick something out from the menu. So they, they brought us the lava cake and that was delicious. So, but now we're fat and happy and we are gonna go to Barnes and Noble and walk around because we like doing that after we stuff ourselves at Longhorn. We stepped into the weirdest area. Like this is a book on the Fitbit charge. The and then we've got like the golden rules of blogging, which should honestly be blogging for dummies. I don't know, we're in the weirdest section. But this is the section Billy likes, so that's fine. That's not true. Insurance, there's a book on insurance. <laughs> If you want to learn how to day trade. I've never been on this area. I have you for that. Oh. <laughs> yeah, well, even I need a book. So, I am going to make dinner. And I was trying to think of what sounded good. And the only thing that I could think of that sounded remotely appetizing. Without having to go out to the store and actually buy ingredients. Well, it's breakfast. So I'm gonna have breakfast for the second time today. <laughs>
that is cooking my little windowsill over here um this you know these are my little sharper image brushes that i got yesterday this is a mug that i got from the giada de Laurentiis, um target baking set which i actually don't use the baking set because it cracks under heat, which is really annoying because it's a baking set. So you would think it wouldn't do that, but whatever. And then these, I got at Target, of course, too, but I need to get new ones because these are wearing out a lot. Um, this little guy I got from the dollar spot at Target for like $3. It's so cute. Um, I used to have incense in it, and then I was like, oh, that's really cute there. So... Then I have my little boo sign for Halloween that I got from the uh, Target dollar spot as well. This is a Peck Sniffs candle. Peck Sniffs makes really good like soaps and stuff and then also candles. Uh, I actually got these a little while ago and they were dying so I decided to hang them up and dry them. Um, I don't know what I'll do with them after. And then this is actually a little ring dish that my mom had with her wedding uh, set. So I keep that um, to put my rings whenever I'm cooking and cleaning so that they don't get messed up. Um, yeah, just really cute. I don't know, I didn't mean for it to end up like that, but it looks cute, so yay. And I think this is done. I had to add some more powder um, because it wasn't thick enough, so I did that. So, yay. So as I was vlogging, every time I would start the vlog, um, Billy would start making noises and I felt really bad. I went in there and I was like, hey, can you stop making noises? <laughs> and then I felt really bad about it. But he plays video games with his brother and his best friend. Um, and they always have so much fun and he'll be in the background going, hey, me, 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 or I don't know, just silly, silly things. And it actually makes me smile a lot when I hear him do that. But he just kept doing it when I started vlogging. And then he would stop when the camera wasn't rolling. And I was like, I swear, I swear. <laughs> so that's Billy's with way more syrup than I meant to give him. And a little Kit Kat bar because I felt bad about yelling at him. So I'm gonna bring that to him. So um, today, most of what I did was cleaned and I did my vlog about my surgery. Um, and then I put up um, that and then also my shopping video from the other day. Um, and yeah, I'm really excited for Saturday because I am volunteering for the Nest Fest. Um, you can just go on the website and you can volunteer. You just apply to volunteer. And um, they pretty much accept it. And it's really cool. You can choose what you want to do. So that's what I did. I'm going to be um, basically helping all the volunteers. So I'll be the person who makes sure that the volunteers have what they need. Um, so I thought that was a really cool thing. I'm a little nervous because I've never done something like that on my own. I've done a ton of stuff like... In church groups growing up things like that um, but never something on my own so I was like oh god I'm not gonna know anyone it's fine but it's really cool like I've been following a lot of the people who have been a part of it like on Instagram and stuff so you know hopefully I'll get to meet some people or something you don't make friends if you don't step out you know, and try a little bit. So I thought it would be something fun to do and also, you know, get in on their inaugural event, which is always fun, always exciting to be a part of the first one. So um, I'll be there, I'm not bringing the dogs. Um, they're gonna have to stay home, uh, but that'll be Saturday. Um, I don't know what I'm gonna do tomorrow. Last night was really fun, but I actually got sick. I think that I just haven't had as rich like a food um since my surgery so it was kind of crazy like how ill i got and how quickly we were at barnes and noble and i was like oh god i'm gonna be sick so 
yeah, and we ended up going home, but that was fine because we both got in bed and snuggled with the dogs and just, you know, watched Harry Potter and chill, so it was good. <laughs> because it is Cheesecake Factory. And then I have a little mixture of pumpkin spice, uh, cinnamon, sugar, sprinkles, and cinnamon and nutmeg in this little dog. Very appropriate for a April dog thing. So, and you just shake it in there. And there we go. That's right. are very jealous. They want it. into it anyway so just a day-to-day -day, just different things that I need to remember list so I'm starting it off with a grocery list so yeah just doing that and watching some Lydia E. Millen Tomorrow I'll probably do um, a lot of organization. I have a lot of things to crack in, so I'm gonna add that to my little list right there. Um, and yeah, if you enjoyed this vlog, uh, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, also the notification bell. And um, yeah, just give the video a like. Thank you so much for hanging out. I hope that you enjoyed it. Bye.